Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. That piece was written by Alvin Baptiste. It's called Al Yellow. That's Alvin Baptiste right there. That's Alvin Baptiste right there. Yeah. Yeah. As far as I'm concerned, that's the best we ever played that song before. I'm really happy. <laughs> Woo, I can use it. That's a, uh, no, I don't think it's really that new, but it's new to this area in this particular form. We've been playing it up in Canada for the last uh, two and a half weeks or so. And uh, this is our, I guess, the end of our third, maybe our fourth week. I don't even remember anymore. We've been working so much uh, as a band. And I'd like to introduce you to all to the members of this aggregation on uh, guitar. Ray Mouton. Yeah. Funny you should mention that. <laughs> Sorry about that. I'm just feeling pretty good. You know, what can I say? Heavy hands. On guitar again, Charles Singleton. Yeah. Contra bass, Randy Jackson on bass. Yeah. Now that I've introduced the aggregation from Baton Rouge, Louisiana, I'll go on to the rest of the band, okay? Last but not least, for sure, and it's not even last, I wouldn't even say that, definitely not least, Mark Soskin from San Francisco, keyboards. Okay. Yeah. Well, I'll tell you, it's really nice to be back in New York City playing at the bottom line again. Yeah. It's fun. <laughs> yeah, it'll never become boring, that's for sure. It's always, you know, intense, the first show, panic, you know. I guess we'll never play well. We'll never play well. Yeah, we play well. Okay. So we'll keep on playing well. And uh, move on with a piece entitled Leeward Wins. And this, this is something that we've been trying to do for a little while. Uh, it's called, it's a lesson in restraint, okay? Now we played out in Long Island, and it was hard trying to play out in Long Island and trying to get everybody to be quiet, you know? Because they are, you know, it's suburban living and everything, you know, you get sort of tired. Of I can understand that, you know? Flip Wilson has a few jokes about it. Bill Crosby has a few jokes about it. Yeah, Flip Wilson has flipped out about it. It's cool. Um, but it's that suburban living, you know, and you know, it's only one tree for a few miles in the house. And so everybody goes, ugh, beer, you know, rock and roll. You know. Uh, yeah. Give me Quailu and all that stuff, you know. Yeah. And we, we don't play any of those tunes, see? So there's a problem. So with that in mind, I, I normally have to say, well, listen, let's try something different, folks. Let's try to yell quietly. Uh, and it worked. So what we're gonna do with Leeward Winds is that we're pretty much gonna just play it as a piece to get away from all that intensity that we do, but intense in another way, as you'll see in a minute. 